Hey guys, it's Moon Desprey and welcome back to my channel and this is gonna be a new series. This is called Wings. Um, it is also known as Wings SMP, but it's more of a group so you're gonna be seeing us not only play on this survival server with many mods, um, we will be on other servers playing mini games, maps, other things like that. We're just gonna be doing a ton of things together. And this is gonna be with the other members of Wings and not to mention it is all girls. Yes, all girls. And I love this concept because I've been wanting to bond with some girls and make some new friends and I thought that this would be a great way which is the reason why I made Wings was to, I guess, unite the girls of the community. Um, so that's what this is. So welcome to Wings. So, I'm going to take you guys on a quick tour of the whole world that we have so far. So we're going to go up here first, and this is basically where all the Wings members live. And let me conclude really quick that all the members are, quote unquote, butterflies. So, I thought it'd be fitting that we could live inside of a, like, a tree, a tree with like little, I guess, entrances in there. I can show you, I'm not too good at flying. Um, so I'm gonna try to try that right now. So let's see. Yeah, there we go. We're flying as a butterfly around spawn. So this is spawn right here. And there, it's basically just like a ton of doors and little houses connected to it. All that good stuff. But look at how fun flying is. But I have to be careful not to use it too much because if I fly too much it, they can break but I can also enchant my wings which is cool as well it also looks like it's using my hunger so I better hurry up and land right here there we go and here is spawn so here at spawn we have a couple of seats we have a little donation bin for if people have stuff they do not need they can plop that in there I'm actually gonna eat really quick um, we do have the nice logo on every door um let's go see what's up here i have not tried flying up here yet so it might be a little tricky i don't know we're about to find out and okay it's not that bad to fly upwards okay i was a little worried about that system but it looks like we'll be fine um we have the board of members right here and we also have the members channels in the description so if you want to check them out you definitely can um this is also like a little diner people well i should say members can buy food here and it's i want to say it's fairly cheap it's not too bad i don't think hopefully that's all leveled out and if we go up here if you don't want to go through that hole um we've got our little mailboxes um, we do have some empty slots so because we may be inviting more members in the future. We do not know yet. But um, these are the mailboxes. So if we want to like give each other things and stuff like that, that's what these are for. And um, we're going to be living hopefully within a vicinity here. So we're probably going to build somewhere around here so we can connect the houses somehow. Hopefully that's what's going to go on. But I'm not entirely sure yet. Um, we do have an ender chest, um, an extra chest, a crafting table, and uh, if we go up here, let's try and fly again. Oh, whoa, okay, that is really fast. I don't know how I did that, but I did. Um, we have a little enchantment table area. It's like a community enchanting table. Um, we have like an XP storing system here. You can store your um, XP here. I guess we'll all be sharing this thing. I'll probably make a private one in my home. Um, there's an empty chest, some furnaces, crafting table, a little like sofa area to just hang out at. And again, you can exit out any of these doors and fly off into your adventure, um, which I'm thinking I'll probably choose where I live in a bit. But I just realized we still have this one spot over here. So I will show you guys what this is as soon as we fly down. I don't want to die. We can do it and land. So we have some fruit trees in the area. If anybody ever gets hungry, I'm actually going to take some of these. I think these are plums. Yes, these are plums. So um, what this is, we have the members not really separated, but we do have them organized into two different groups. They don't really change anything, but maybe we'll turn it into like a mini game type sorting system. So we'll do like what monarch butterflies versus sapphire butterflies here. Um, so that's basically what this is going to be. Maybe that's maybe what we'll, we'll do. Maybe if we have some like, I guess, competitive mini game where we have to split the teams up. But, um, basically it's just, we have two different kinds of butterfly members and we have the mon the monarchs over here 
and the sapphire here. And um, as you can see, I am a monarch, which I thought would be super cool. Um, I just love how orange looks, but I love it. And um, over here we have sapphire butterflies, and they can buy a new set of wings if they cannot find um, the components or materials needed to craft new ones. You know, if you have diamonds, this is the way to go. And um, we also have these little shopping stands here if they ever want to sell things. Um, so that's cool. And then we have the same thing on the other side. We have the monarch vending machine there for the butterflies if they run out. And other little stands. And then here in the middle, I thought it'd be really cool to have, I guess, a system to make things fun. I don't know what you would call this, but I'll just read it out to you guys. We've got first butterfly to collect a diamond, first butterfly to defeat the wither, and so on. We just have a ton of achievements to achieve, basically. And the item frames are there, so in that way we can put our custom skulls in there, and so we can see who has gotten it. So basically, if I were to grab mine, and I got the first diamond, I could put mine right there. So, yeah, we got kind of like a little competitive fun Thing in there so I don't know I thought that would be cool so we have that and yeah so I think I'm gonna maybe choose a place to live or get some materials I'm not sure we'll see what happens next all right so I found this biome here I'm not sure what it's called but all the trees are different colors except for some of them um, there's mushrooms there's flowers on the ground and I love this one and I'm thinking since it seems the wings break pretty easily um, I'm gonna do a boat path to spawn if I ever need to get anything so we're gonna have a like a little boat system probably sometime soon so we're gonna cut down these trees and I wonder what kind of wood it gives see it's called dogwood and oh my gosh the color of the wood is adorable so we're gonna make a crafting table and we're gonna go ahead and try and clear out some of the forest and maybe next episode we'll go on a mining trip with some girls hopefully but uh yeah so if we cut down this area here i think this is where i want to build my house and i'm thinking right where i'm standing could be like the boat dock i guess and I know that before, when I first got into Minecraft, I would build my boat docks out of slabs. I'd put the slabs right by the water, so that way you can just, like, ride the boat right into the slabs. And it wouldn't break, and it'd just kind of settle there. Um, which, I don't know. It looks... It, the only thing I didn't like about it is just how it looked. It looked funny that there was a boat out of water, if that makes sense. It just kind of looks a little funny. But, um, I think... I might make a little boat dock where it comes inside a little bit but I'm super excited to set it up I the only thing is I do not know what I want to build for my home so if you guys have ideas please let me know what kind of house to build because I do not know um, there can be all sorts of kinds of houses there were some bubbles here I don't know where those bubbles came from um, but I do not know what kind of house I want to build I'm thinking maybe it could be a mushroom it could be a tree it could be like a little hobbit hole it could be um, I don't know what else it could be like a little cottage which I'm really attracted to the cottage because I think a cottage would be really cute I don't know what else kind of like fairy like butterfly houses there could be I don't know why I'm making stairs <laughs> Um, but I don't know what else other kinds of houses that there I can make but if you have any idea please let me know and you cannot make tools out of these wood okay oh this is a problem I'm sure there's but birch no okay there's oak wood here I was like no we have nothing to make out of and there's some bushes here I think we can get those with shears and I know that they give berries. I don't know if these grow back or not. And it turns out flying can make you very hungry very quick. So we're going to need a stable food source sometime soon. And as some of our member starter items, we got some berries. So I don't want to eat all of them. Although it looks like I already ate one kind. I don't know which one I ate all of. <laughs> I think I did. I'm not sure. Um, but we're going to save those. And that way we can make a little farm out of them. Um, I want to try to stay strictly <laughs> vegan in this series just for roleplay aspect. I think it'd be a cute little challenge. So, I don't know. There's an idea. Ooh, I love that sound. Okay. Alright, so we have some basic wooden tools. And I'm just going to go ahead and... Oh, I don't know if I want my boat dock here. Okay, you know what? I definitely do. And we're going to have... 
Do you want the water to come in here or not? I'm gonna have the water come in just a little bit so that way the boat can come in. Oh, that block did not break. Okay, there we go. Um, and we can make it a four, four by three maybe? And we'll put some wood on the side, which would make it a two by three, I believe. And we'll put some steps up the side, and it's just going to look really nice. And I'm super excited to start on my house. Um, but let me know if you guys want to see me build my house on camera or off camera. Just the only thing is, if I do it on camera, um, it is going to take a while. So I'm not sure if that's something you guys are interested in watching. But yeah, it's, it's going to take a little bit. Um, so let's see. We're going to go ahead and make... Wait, I should have kept those because I kind of want to leave it kind of log there. Well, we can make it out of the dogwood because I actually like how the dogwood looks. I'm going to put some dogwood here on the side. And then so if we drive into this boat dock. Is this too? No, that's fine. Okay, and then we can do some steps somewhere. Should we do on that side? We'll move it over some, put some steps. Which I think I'll do. So I'm going to move this over. And we'll think of some other things to build. And I know that we have a bird mod in here. Um, which is also in my other series. Um, my little safari. So we can have a little. I guess. Maybe like we can have a little. Area for birds. I don't know what kind of birds yet. But there's always that. Okay there we go. That looks better. And we're also going to make. I don't know what color steps I want here. Should we make them pink? We'll make pink steps, I think. There we go. I kind of consider this a pink color. So we should put steps... We put them up here or here? Oh, we'll go put them there. Yeah, that's a cool area. So, yeah, and then... Uh, I think... Was there a fish down here? I thought I saw a fish. Okay. Alright, so I went mining a little bit, and there it seems to be a rainbow ore there, which I'm hoping is for a new set of wings, because I do want to start a, I guess, a wing collection. So then that way I could have not only different types of wings, which I'll probably still stick to traditional monarch butterfly wings, but just to have like a collection of different kinds of wings that I could wear. Um, but that would help, because... <laughs> that these are kind of breaking even from that little joy ride and we can enchant them to unbreaking which uh, can be totally useful can we burn this log i hope this turns to charcoal because that's what we need we need torches so we can see what is down there there's a bird somewhere um but i love this biome it has so many different kinds of color vines there's the white ones with different color flowers there seems to be yellow over there i can kind of see in some purple and there's blue right here which is so pretty um and there's just so many different kinds of flowers i'm so excited to start my home right here um so let's see i, th I think is it done okay we got two charcoal which is good so we're gonna go ahead and make some torches really quick oh that's not how you make a torch this is how you make a torch and we're just gonna hold it because we have dynamic lights and okay so can i get it with this stone pickaxe is the question i don't want to risk it so let's go ahead and smelt the iron ore really Ooh, what was that sound this kind of scared me um okay so let's go ahead and smelt the iron ore i don't know if that's gonna be enough to do that but oh well uh, let's get some more cobble too there we go and while i'm at it guys go ahead and name your favorite kind of butterfly and i also want to know what's your favorite color because i do hear a lot of basic colors like red blue yellow which is awesome but if anybody has a complex described favorite color do let me know because people think it's funny that my favorite color is pink or not pink but peach and they're like wow that's it's really complex i'm like it's not really that complex um but let's go ahead and make this pickaxe really quick and then we're gonna get started into this i'm so excited so let's go ahead and get this pickaxe and oh what is above here guys that is so creepy did anybody see okay hold on let's, let's dig this there's nothing there this 
This mining area is haunted. Okay, let's mine this. <gasps> fairy dust. Just what we need. So with fairy dust, we can make... Let's see. We can make fairy wings with just like... Okay, so we can make just fairy wings out of this. I think that's the only thing. I don't know. Yeah, seems like it. So we can make fairy wings so we can add that to the collection. So I might just sell some of this though too. So yeah. So that'll be that for this episode guys. And if you guys can't wait to see the next episode, let me know and I'll try my hardest to get the next one out. And if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like, comment down below. And again, let me know what kind of house you guys think I should build. And yeah, bye guys.